Welcome to the DIY Pardot implementation course. Pardot, also known as Marketing Cloud Account Engagement, is not the easiest thing to integrate yourself. So most people who purchase Pardot end up using a partner, like us, to get it set up and integrated for them. Well, in this course, we're gonna walk you through, step by step, the process that we take to get those clients technically integrated. By the end of the course, you will be ready to go. You'll be ready to create your first campaign and send your first email. Now, typically, a Pardot implementation is gonna run you thousands of dollars, but we've taken what we've learned and we've compressed it down into this course so that you can go through those steps yourself. And you could actually always have done it yourself. The Salesforce documentation is available online for free. The challenge with the Salesforce documentation is that it assumes you have a lot of background information to make sense of it. And if you're new as a system administrator or you're a new consultant to Salesforce, uh, you probably don't have that background information. It's gonna be really difficult navigating that documentation to get everything technically set up. So what we're gonna do is go through videos step-by-step step, showing you how to do that implementation. And as we do it, I'll explain what the different pieces are for and explain some of that background information to help you navigate and make the right decision at different junctions in the project. Now let's talk about who this course is for and who it isn't for. So this course is for somebody that is new to Pardot. You just purchased Pardot from Salesforce and now you need to get it technically implemented in your Salesforce environment. I wouldn't recommend this for somebody that's had Pardot for a while and you're worried that it was never set up correctly. Those are, are typically Pardot audits and there's many different ways that things can go wrong or different sorts of customizations that could have happened. And this course is really starting from a blank slate, from a new org, not from one that's been around for a while. If you need extra help with that, there's plenty of great consultants that can help look at your environment and straighten things out for you. The other thing to keep in mind if you're considering going through this course is how customized your Salesforce environment is or how customized you think the part of implementation needs to be. What we've set out here is the steps and the instructions. It's gonna work for 80% of the people. And honestly, probably more than that. But there are definitely some Salesforce environments that are heavily customized using lots of custom objects. And if they were looking to use some of that custom object data, as part of their marketing campaigns, there's extra steps that are required to get everything set up so you can see that data and leverage it in Pardot. And we're not gonna be able to go through those sorts of customizations because there's just too many varieties, too many possibilities of what that could look like. So if you just purchased Pardot and need to get it set up and you're using a fairly typical implementation of Salesforce, then this is a great resource for you. So let's also talk about what this course is and, and what it isn't. So this course, is a technical implementation. We're gonna get Pardot connected to Salesforce, have data moving back and forth. We'll get DNS set up so that Pardot is authorized to send emails from your domain. We'll even show you how to add the JavaScript to your website. What we're not gonna cover is actually how to build out campaigns. You know, How do you use those features in Pardot to accomplish your marketing goals within Salesforce? Well, this is all about that technical setup. So we actually have another course called the One Week Pardot course that goes through all those features and and teaches you how to best use those to build out campaigns. Definitely recommend that you use both of these courses together if you're looking for, for both. How do we get it technically set up? And then how do you actually use Pardot moving forward? And finally, let's talk about prerequisites. So of course, you need to have Pardot. You would have had to already have purchased that from Salesforce. And you need to be a system administrator within the system in order to have enough permissions to go through all the steps that we're talking about. It's also great if you have access to your website and you have access to your DNS settings, but those aren't strictly necessary because when we get to that part of the process, we'll give you email templates that you can then send on and forward to the technical person or the IT team to walk them through how to make those changes in case you don't have access. Our hope with this course is to make it easier and faster to get Pardot implemented for small businesses. Going through this course, you shouldn't need a partner to help you implement it unless you run into a, a use case that's outside of the standard, in which case we do highly recommend you reach out to a Pardot consultant to help you sort that out. The reason we created this course is to help make Pardot more accessible to small businesses. Sometimes that implementation cost can be a barrier to adopting this technology. 
And we wanna see more people and organizations leverage technology. So if you're ready to go step-by-step -step to get Pardot technically integrated, then please join this course today. And if you'd like to try out the course before purchasing, we've actually made a preview available for free. Go ahead and sign up and you can test out the lessons yourself. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in the first lesson.